so we're going to get this started again. We just finished with Renee. Tomorrow night, I'm going to have one of the toughest matches of my career, fighting Davy Boy Smith Jr. We're not starting yet, are we? We are starting, yeah. They didn't get my hotel yet, did we? We'll deal with that after. Teddy Hart is going to be wrestling me tomorrow night, along with Davy Boy Smith Jr., his cousin. He has eight by tens here. He will be signing some after the show, and he'll definitely be signing them tomorrow night as well. Definitely, in my opinion, the greatest high flyer in the world today. The daredevil stuff he has accomplished is just incredible. He's the current MLW middleweight champion, Teddy Hart. I've had a bit of a long day. You've super long day. I didn't know you were starting on me. Like I thought you're I thought you were ribbing me. No, we had the break and we thought that uh, you were yeah, gonna be ready. I thought it was like an hour away at the show from the airport. I've been driving for six hours, I just wanted to shower and then I couldn't get I'm pretty sure I like unless it's just like somebody set it up, but you know my name's not that. Teddy Hart, my shoot name. So when I get a hotel room, usually they, if they get the airplane ticket for me, usually they get the hotel room under my name. But I waited almost two hours to get into that room and they couldn't get me into the room. And you're busy, I, I was told or whatever, but you're right up the street. And I thought you were actually doing a show or you're a wrestling thing, you're doing this shit. That, you kept me waiting for two hours doing this shit, dude. Well, we were setting up in here, Sorry, we were setting up uh, for, kids, for yesterday, is, or for tomorrow as well. Like, you're, you're, I'm one of, you're on the poster, I didn't expect there to be any issues with... Uh, you're one, I'm one of your biggest fans, man, but, and, and I appreciate, I appreciate, this is, this is like what I'm all about, is taking care of the people and making sure they get an intimate atmosphere to talk and ask questions and stuff, but the, to me, it's one of those things, if the guy who you brought in doesn't even know I'm doing an interview, you didn't explain it to me, right? And you told me it was an hour, I thought, from the building to here, and then it's like six hours of driving with some guy, and he couldn't drive right, man. And then he told me to wait at the hotel that I'd be getting in, and then he said, dude, Devin wants to talk to you, and then I come over here. I understand, he just took a bit of a detour. Uh, he booked dude, the hotel room. I won two belts at MLW, you announced me as this super, star high flyer you know i've been wrestling with you for 24 years i was the first guy to ever bring into mat rats i take that as disrespect one picture with for and what am i supposed to sign it with what do you mean what are you supposed to sign it with dude i thought we were friend. gonna have a match we are you friend. know what you're one of my oldest friends well then don't bring me in like a jobber dude you bring harry in now too to wrestle me i'm an mlw we're not supposed to be doing anything with harry you know better man the, the Harry Hashtag told me he was up for it. Harry told me he was up for it. Well, what are you going to say? No? You're one of the, we don't want to let you down. You're a shooter. All right, why don't we talk about something else? Yeah, this is... There's a dog in the audience here. See that shit, dude? The dog senses it, dude. The dog senses it. That to me, I'm a big animal cat guy, dog guy. That's that's a shoot. That dog is a cat You ask him a question. You ask him a question. I know you had a long day. I'll give you a break, though. This is not the place to come on. Dude, I don't even care, man. That's no, no, no. some shit. Every time I try to do something nice, I change my reputation. I worked for two years. You're the first guy to do an interview with me out of jail and ask me every question in the world. I got heat for some of the questions that I answered truthfully on that video. And I took those down. Yeah, I know, but still, you're the idiot that put the questions <laughs> on there. You, you're the guy that don't set me up again. Don't start this. Set me up, Calm man. Down, brother, I'm, I'm usually super easy going. I'm trying to, I'm trying to start restart this. my comeback. You're lucky tomorrow's Harry. Just you, you got Harry in there as an excuse, dude. What are you going to do? Nothing. Oh, 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 easy, brother. I'm wearing a fucking... Okay, 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 calm down. Shane, you're going to punk me now with your <laughs> room here? No, 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 <laughs> Come on, man. Can't just, you can't just take it easy. Get this guy... Dude, no, 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 Hannibal TV is... I love Hannibal TV. Rocky wannabe with your little tiger on your shirt. Yeah, the tiger. Tiger. Living in Philadelphia. Philadelphia is the biggest shithole I've ever seen. It's a dump, and you are... Come on, wait, come on, wait, come on. Come on. Just no, 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 no. Renee, get him out of here, man. I told you, the guy's a piece of the shoot.